Hi everybody, it's Tawela here from OSHA Slings. Um, I hope you're all having a good Monday so far. Uh, nice to be back with some new releases. Um, I'll just give us a couple of minutes and wait for more people to, um, to show up. And if uh, somebody could share the link into the clan, that would be brilliant. Thank you very much. Um, so just while we're waiting, Obviously you can see I have this uh, lovely cowl on, I'm going to talk about that in a minute. Um, but has anybody done anything unusual this week? Um, I was on jury service last week, which was something really out of the ordinary for me. Um, quite, I suppose, a serious undertaking, luckily not a long trial, but yeah, really interesting um, to be involved in that process. And but also nice that everybody was kind of taking it seriously. So yes, not to bring us down, but sometimes that is life. <laughs> so yes, if you've done anything out of the ordinary this last week or two, I'd love to know. Hi Vanessa, thanks for joining. Um, yeah, so I'm excited that we are bringing back or have brought back our Earth Warp for Autumn. So I've got the next two releases on that to show you. And obviously our lovely scarf release as well for this week, uh, Ray Riku, which I'm showing off here as a cowl. Um, I'll just give us a couple more minutes and see if anyone else wants to join us um, and then I will get started. Um, oh thanks Vanessa for sharing the link that's brilliant. Great um, so um, as you can see we've got a, a new scarf release for you this week and it's a, a new type of fabric for us so doubly exciting. Um, Ray Riku is on our jewel warp, so our three colour jewel sail warp. So it's these really rich tones of uh, kind of teal green going through this deep blue and then the kind of garnet red at the top there. Um, and as some of you eagle-eyed lot have spotted, this is piece silk. So we've woven for the first time with a full piece silk weft for our sail scarves, um, which I hope you'll agree looks really stunning um, and it's just oh, it's so lovely to wear, it's so soft. Um, our scarves are being stitched as we speak, so I don't actually have one in hand, but I can show you the infinity loop, so just kind of flipping it round there to give you an idea of the backside of the fabric. Um, oh, Vanessa says, a uh, new type of fabric, amazing, anything else planned? Oh, not on this run, however, we all love it, so I think it's safe to say there will be more. <laughs> we just need to uh, plan it and make it happen, but uh, yes, that's good. All positive votes, please keep them coming because that helps us know what to make next. Um, so yeah, you've just got this gorgeous texture of the piece of silk really coming out there and because it's that fine um, sail warp it really lets the weft kind of stand out and do its thing and obviously against the skin it is so lovely and soft to wear and um, so it's quite thin in hand it comes in at about um, 144 gsm which is heavier than our standard sails they tend to sit closer to um, 100 110 GSM, um, but it still feels lovely and light being silk. Um, I think this will make a great um, almost year round um, sort of neck piece scarf that you can wear indoors or out um, depending on the time of year. So uh, yes, I'll just give you a quick look. Um, I'll pop the cowl off and I will put on the infinity loop because I think there's something nice about seeing that um, texture of the back when you're wearing it. So just to give you an idea, actually before I put that on, I know you've all seen the stunning pictures uh, with Sylvia, but you can just imagine that sort of draped round for, um, you know, an autumn or winter event, uh, those jewel tones and uh, the weft, I think are gonna make such a lovely combination. So this is, quite limited in quantity. Uh, so there's about 20 scarves and um, a few. I'll need Holly to maybe check me on that, whether that's 20 scarves in addition to the cowls and the infinity loops or altogether. I think it's in addition, but um, I'll ask Holly just to confirm on that. 
Um, so yeah, just giving you a look there at that um, infinity loop and how that sits. So although that looks thicker than some of our scarves, it's got a really lovely drape. So it just sits so comfortably down there around your neck. And then you've got that gorgeous texture coming around um, there. So I'll just check, there's a couple of questions and comments. Um, oh, Daisy says, still no captions. Hmm, I am not sure if that is something I can fix. Um, I might ask Holly to have a look uh, and see if that's something that can be looked at. Oh, sorry, Stormy, I'm trying to read your comment. There we go. Is this the jewel work that Simba Elk? Uh, or is this the same as the Lothlorien and Willow scarves? It is uh, the same as the Lothlorien and Willow. Um, obviously inspired a bit by uh, the original jewel wrap warp. Um, obviously Starry Night Agartha is not dissimilar to this kind of colourway, um, which was another lovely one. Uh, but yes, this is a sail warp, so it's got that really nice lightness to it. Um, and you're really feeling the piece silk because uh, the cotton kind of sits back from it a bit. Um, so yeah, just check that I've not missed anyone. <laughs> oh, you see my cute nails, thank you. I had to bring some of my summer holiday home with me. I was in Malawi for three weeks and I just, I couldn't resist. It was so nice and sunny and I just had to go and get them done. Uh, it doesn't go at all with any of the releases today, but here we are. Thank you, Chip, for making that comment. <laughs> I'll try and get my nails done more often. Um, Linda says, lovely colour combo. Could we have wrap releases like this? Oh, yes. Um, well, we have. We may again. Keep your eyes peeled. Oh, Ren is loving it too. Oh, thank you. Cool. Um, Great. Well, that is uh, Ray Riku for now. I'm glad you're enjoying that one. We all are too. So uh, yes, get in there uh, if that is what you fancy. I think it's going to make a really stunning accessory um, worn either way up the teal or the red, just depending what your outfit is and what your mood is for the day. Um, yeah, I think that's going to be stunning. Uh, there we go. I will pop that aside. Um, so next I'm going to talk you through our first, the first of our wrap releases. Uh, so the Briarwood Acorn is on our very popular Earth Warp, which we all love. So it's working with the three colour uh, weft grad that uh, we used in Ancients of Gondor Acorn uh, on the original Earth warp. So again, just picking out those really gorgeous colours that just look like a walk in an autumn wood. Um, so I'll just pop that on so you can see how that looks. Um, make sure, I always get this wrong, get this the right way up. <laughs> oh. So as you're probably aware, this one is uh, our five ply bamboo viscous so it's got that really nice um, bit of cushy feel to it a slight bit of bounce if that's what you kind of go for in a wrap but it is is super soft so it's very suitable for um, even small babies I'd say from from newborn um, may we get loom shots for vivid oh um, I think you are referring to the uh, peel and I think those will come when they're ready. Is, th is that what you're talking about, Jacqueline, the Vivid, uh, vivid Dream Peel? Because um, those, those will come <laughs> um, and they will definitely be sent out when we have them. We always get very excited for those coming in. Sometimes I ask for loom shots even when it's not a pre-order because I just enjoy seeing them so much. Uh, so yes, my, my WhatsApps are a really weave geeky whatsapp <laughs> library of photos just pop baby in there and um, so the colors we have on this are um jester red uh, bitter chocolate and hawaiian sunset so that's that kind of bright red there going into the bitter chocolate and then on the other side the hawaiian sunset kind of adding that really autumnal 
um, rusty orange um, in there. So the bamboo viscous is really soft. Um, so straight out of the bag, that should be really easy to handle. I think it's a really good blend for um, beginner wrappers, uh, those who are maybe still kind of getting to grips with it. And if your baby's still learning to get to grips with it, um, it can be a nice, quick and quite um, forgiving blend. I think it moulds around you both really easily. Um, so those kind of first outing wrap jobs <laughs> will hold in place, um, even if you're still finding your way around them. So the blend of this is 58% BCI organic combed cotton and 42% uh, bamboo viscous. And uh, this one, unfortunately, the theme of today, this is very limited as well. So this will be made to order only. Um, we wove about 46 metres, which usually translates to about 20 to 23 wraps. So again, this is one to um, look out for and set your reminders. Uh, if you're keen on this one, but yeah, a lovely classic pattern for the autumn um, and hopefully lots of you be, will be enjoying that. Um, um, sorry, I think I lost signal there. I hope I'm back. <laughs> um, hopefully that hasn't interrupted things too much. I'll just pop this off and then I can get baby into our next release. So just check as well in case I've missed any comments or questions. Um, oh, Ren says, time to pencil in a work appointment for Wednesday. <laughs> yes, oh, I know, I'm so sorry. We make you work so hard <laughs> for these releases. Um, hopefully they are worth it. Um, so our next release is Lairad Ren. And this is an exciting one because uh, we were recently asked, oh, Jacqueline, thank you for confirming. Still glitching, but it seems to pick up where it left off. Okay, that's good. I'll, I'll just keep going <laughs> and hopefully, hopefully we'll be okay. Um, but do comment and ask questions if there's anything you miss at any point and I will come back and uh, make sure I come back uh, at the end to check. So we've got our Lairad pattern um, from the Norse uh, Tree of Life motif and we were asked to uh, consider a mirrored version and so we thought that would be a great idea and then we had a bit of space left on the earth warp and thought let's give that a go. Trees on the earth warp, it seems to fit. So we have this lovely one of a kind release uh, which uh, has been made using um, stock weft yarns. So again, using up uh, yarns that otherwise would probably be discarded um, or go to um, landfill. So it's always really nice for us when we're able to use these. Uh, so the, oh, sorry, having a bit of a, a moment there. I'll just wrap this round a little and then I'll talk to you about the wefts. So we've got three wefts alternating on this one. Um, we've got our flame red tussa, which is giving you those lovely flecks, the kind of red and yellow flecks that are popping through that. Um, and also which you can sort of see speckling the fabric on the other side, which I think is a really gorgeous effect. Um, oh, hello Jess, thanks for joining. Uh, then we've got uh, Orange Rust Organic Cotton and uh, this paler yellow is Samoan Sun um, Organic Cotton. So uh, those three working together to give this kind of slightly pinstriped. Um, oh, thank you, Jacqueline. <laughs> oh, I know what it's like. You've got to get back to them. Thanks for joining for the time that you did. Um, yeah, so then when you stand back, those colours kind of mix optically to give you that sort of um, orangey, slightly glowy effect um, across the warp. So that can be worn either way up, um, higher contrast in the with the green rail up, but um, also a really nice effect, I think more subtle with the red rail up. So that is really personal preference and then a fun kind of back reverse side of the fabric to show off too. Um, so 
our tester Jenny reviewed this and gave us some uh, a lovely review and some lovely photos so do go and check her review out on Clan um, whenever you get a chance and she says straight out of the bag it is soft smooth and quite thin in hand uh, after a bath the fibres have popped with a beautiful bloom so I think this is definitely one that will um, come into its own with continued wear and use and just get better and better which is always a good a good uh, property for a wrap to have so let's get that tightened up there so the blend of this one is 81% BCI organic combed cotton and 19% confetti shantung tussa silk uh, and that comes in at about 280 gsm very similar to the briarwood i think i didn't mention the the gsm of that one but um both of these wraps are quite mid-weight um, good all-rounders uh, and i'd say this one probably with the tussa silk content um uh, even more suitable to go through uh, to carrying bigger kids and into toddlerhood as well so one that you'll hopefully get plenty of wear out of um, again this is a limited quantity wrap that wasn't the intention uh, but these things happen because of that slip up we got the hobbit and 111th birthday so we try to make silver linings and um, so for this one we'll have ready-made wraps uh, no ring slings ready to make ready-made uh, and then a limited made to order so if you're after a ring sling and um, you need to place that order through the end made to order um, section of the, the listing uh, yes hope that makes sense <laughs> uh, yeah so this is really supportive and strong and it's got that bit of cushiness from the tussa uh, so that should yeah be able to carry carry your kids for long distances and for a, a long time as well so that's Lairad Wren and yes very much hope that we'll be bringing you more of the Lairad uh, in due course but uh, yes hopefully you'll agree this was a nice first outing for it and um, so let me know if you've got any questions I'll just check here so I've not missed any um, back here oh Nancy says so pretty loving the weft thank you <laughs> yay that's always nice to hear great um so I guess that is uh, most of what I was going to tell you today. Just a very brief um, reminder that we do have our uh, latest uh, customer-led PO opening today. So Mel has been leading that one, um, the Northern Lights pre-order. Uh, so they, she has put together with the group this really beautiful seven color warp. Um, and that is opening imminently uh, at 4 p.m. today. BST. So uh, get over there. I will let you all go in the next few minutes so you can head over and have a look. Um, not a limited pre-order, so because it's full custom, uh, there's no time pressure to you know make your orders. So take your time, have a browse, um, see what you think. But yeah, I think this is going to be gorgeous, and um, I think sort of in keeping with the the jewel tones on the Ray Riku, maybe a bit. Yeah, similar vibes so <laughs> while you're there have a look at uh, what else is on offer but uh, yeah go and get some of that gorgeous uh, warp action and um, I think that is that is all of the information I have for you today um, I hope I've answered any questions but um, as ever do pop them in the comments and uh, Holly or I will get back to you after uh, so I hope you all have a great week uh, enjoy the pre-order and the new releases and I will be back very soon. Thanks. Bye.